Head of the Traffic and Highway Patrol Branch Acting Senior Superintendent Wayne Meister said to date they have recorded 31 instances of road fatalities for 2022. For the same period in 2021, the figure was 24. He said there is a 29% increase in road fatalities. The Traffic and Highway Patrol Branch will be working assiduously um, within um, 2022 to ensure that that figure goes down dramatically. And we will have a lot of um, activities taking place that will ensure that these um, fatalities go down. And again, we're working together with our stakeholders to ensure that there's um, proper roadway safety. Road Safety Coordinator Sergeant Brent Batson said the TTPS has noticed a pattern by drivers, especially on the highways. At 100 kilometers an hour, you know, you're looking at at least five car lengths you're supposed to be, but persons are still following the other vehicles too close. So when something happens, nobody has time to react. So we're asking everybody to please pay attention, leave more space, all right? Give yourself more time to react. He's asking the public to wear their seat belts. We continue to see a lot of people ejected from the vehicles, which again is suggesting lack of seat belt use. Now what is interesting, because of the digital U-turn ticketing system, lack of seat belt use is still the number one most ticketed behavior on the roadways. And I thought we were past that because everybody realizes how important it is to wear seat belts. And although it isn't part of the law, Sergeant Batson is recommending that rear seat passengers wear seat belts as well. He reminded that children five and under must be in the back seat in a child's seat. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.